Okay, hello everybody. We are continuing Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. No, why no? You can see it load in. Ah, okay. Fifteen there, but I only need ten for this, so, um... I can just go over here. Thanks. Oh wait, I want to see this. Remastered. Nice. And it loaded instantly, so that's cool. Yeah, that taxi... texture... Mm. That texture was not so good. Ah, uh, Goo Lagoon. A sun-wrenched beach of sludge popping. at the bottom of the sea. But, all is not well here on Paradise. Man, I heard this was bad on the, uh, Switch version, not on, uh, PlayStation. You've just met the Spongenator. Or who knows, maybe it's just these first few levels. But they get, then again, pretty much all the info I have about this game uh, is from online reviews and stuff, it's just from the early review copies. Monsoon. Ah, there we go, the main theme. during the trailers. SpongeBob, do I look burned? Well, you do look a little red. It would have been cool if this game that did what the uh, Spyro and Crash robot. remakes did, where they uh, yeah, also remake the music, stole everybody's but, sunscreen. you know, it is oh, what it no. is. Oh no! Everyone will burn, and then they'll get all itchy and peel. Exactly. I you mean, even if you like the, the original music, you still, in those remakes, had the option between that the original the songs Nobody or can get the to him. remade soundtrack. SpongeBob, maybe you can use those sun reflectors to point the sun's rays on that robot. If you hit one of the buttons on the side of a lifeguard tower, the reflector will turn. Connect all the towers and the light will shoot right out of the big reflector on the island. Then all you have to do is swim I'm going to be the honest though, when I played the, the uh, Spyro the Reignited trilogy, I was actually planning on uh, <laughs> and putting the, the setting to the original music. But I uh, can't swim. But I guess I forgot to do that and um, ended up having the remastered soundtrack. But I'll be honest, the remastered soundtrack is actually pretty good. So I kept it on. It was kind of cool to see Somehow me. I don't think he needs a hand. Kinda cool to hear new versions of the old classics. I love opening presents. Fresh like a spring breeze. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Okay, I must need to do something else first. I actually remember this being one of the longest levels in the game. Even though it's only the third level. But then again, I was basically doing a completionist run, so maybe it won't be as long this time.
Ah, if only I could get over there. Huh, that spins when you hit it. Cool. And it gives you a sign. So, win win. There we go. Mm. No. Yes, there we go. I will say one thing I am not looking forward to is rock bottom. Because I hate that level. It's just so bland and goes on for so long. I am not looking forward to that. First try on that one. Let's see here. No, okay, of course not. Ah, there's a way for me to get up there. Aha, uh -huh. I must need Patrick now. So where can I change? I do see Mrs. Puff over there, so maybe I could go over there. But I don't see anything over there. Oh no! The children's balloons have been overfilled! They're carrying the children out of control! I don't know, Mrs. Puff. It looks like they're having a lot of fun. Yes, too much fun, if you ask me. You can save the children by bubble bashing each of the balloons. Bubble bash all the balloons, then come see me for a reward. Can do, Mrs. Puff. Balloons are like the hooks. You were warned. But did you listen? Let's 
Okay, come over here. Oh. Somehow I don't think he needs a hand. There we go. Okay, got out of there just in time. I feel like a new sponge. Hmm, I could go up there. You got a sock, so let's go do that. Patrick will be glad to have this back. Here we go. Take that! And there's got to be another one somewhere in there. Here we go, this is where I can change to Patrick. I can't get up there though. It actually looks like I need to be Spongebob over there, so it seems like I just go all the way around. Back to what I was doing earlier. Went big, or went home at the end there. And we made it big. Here we go again. Have you been lonely out there all alone? All of that was for a suck. You see what Larry says. Ooh, present in every one. You know, we should talk about personal gym training sometime. I thought the gym was already trained. <laughs> I thought the gym was already trained. Okay, so I guess there's nothing back there. Actually, why don't I try the box? Ah, uh, okay, I don't have any other box to teleport to. So we're taking the long way. You can't go in there. Oh, I don't know why I did all that then. Let's go in. 
the ground. Here we go. There, saved. There's another one over there. Okay, I'm gonna oh, these things fall if I don't. If I stand on them too long. Oh uh, no. Okay, oh. That's an occasion of going big or going home, and then with the going home result. As demonstrated before, I could only save them by doing this move. Sponge Smasher. To be 100 robots is Spongebob. Who knows, I might end up platinum in this game. There we go. Save them all. Grab that. My hero! You've saved the children! <laughs> Here's a golden spatula as a reward. There we go. If you hit one of the buttons on the side of a lifeguard tower, the reflector will turn. Connect all the towers and shoot the light out to the big reflector on the island. When the light is pointed at the island, go there and turn the last reflector. So, which one's the big one? I don't want to mess this up and have to do the whole thing over again. I love opening presents. I mean, I thought the one all the way over there would be the big one, but it only has two reflecting off of it. Guess I'll try it. Just my side. Fresh like a spring breeze. Yeah, that's probably the big one all the way in the way. So can I make it from there? Oh yeah, yeah, I can, I've done this before. Shortcut. I feel 
like a new sponge. I probably just suck in making this look a lot more complicated than it is. Somehow I don't think he needs a hand. I mean, that's just the way I am in general with platform games, honestly. I take way too long to do anything. So I can't get there from here. So I guess I have to go the other way around. Ah, great. Now I have to go through a really long road time. But I guess while I'm going through all this is a good time to address that, uh... Um, since I'll probably still be playing this, 99% chance um, on Sunday. I mean, next Friday. Not only that, but um, I don't really think this is gonna be like a big thing to stream. Like, I wouldn't really be. I mean, I don't. I I think it's gonna be good and all, but like, you know, streaming it just eh. Sponge I'd rather Bob, just play it on I my own that time. Collecting golden spatulas. Um, yes, bubble buddy. And I I'm am. also surprised that they're one? doing it so quickly. Why, yes! We were but, having um, a sandcastle when contest, Red Room Takeover happens in the, the Avengers game, I, if I had a will castle, not be streaming I'd name it. it Fort Patty Town the Third, and Fort Patty Town the Third would have a big bake sale every Monday. Um, the golden spatula. Oh, at the top of the sand castle, right! That should be easy to reach. Well, perhaps you should see for yourself. Fresh like a spring breeze. Here we go. Water rising must get to. Fire. Oh no. Did you see that? The water was like glitching. And it just did it again. Oh, it looks like I could go around. Okay, finally, progress. Now what? Because I can't go down there. Okay, break this. I can't jump up there.
Oh, I can go on this. Sorry, when I see something like that, I just think it's part of the background. The first uh, Spyro game also had a moment like that. Statue will get. And now we proceed to the next area. Hello, Gary. What's new? Ow. You don't say. Squidward bought a new sweater. Oh, he's so crazy. Ow. And there's a golden spatula at the end the of this The best hardware striped wow. sweater is all the time. There's a golden spatula at the end of this cave? No. Thanks, Gary! <laughs> when I hit Gary, all he really does is blink. Hey, I can jump on these. A riskier route, but faster. Here we go. Tiki go boom. Thank you. Perfect. Tartar sauce. Uh. That those rising levels were really inconsistent. Go SpongeBob! Go SpongeBob! Go SpongeBob! I think I remember it being like that on the PS2 version though too. camera angle but uh look at this patterning reminds me of a pop tart this video is sponsored by pop tarts ha take that tag back tv i'm the first youtuber to be sponsored by pop tarts Once again, shout out to good old Tago. He recently restarted his iron. Another spatula, so we got one more until we get 20.
So 20 should be enough for another level after the Poseidon, which that in of itself should give us at least one spatula. So we should be good. Mr. Krabs. Oh, I remember this. This part's cool. SpongeBob, help me find Patrick. I have a task that I think he can help me with. No problem. Sorry, lad, but the carnival is closed. The pesky robot has taken over me ticket booth. And worse, me money. If you help me get rid of that no good robot, I'll give you a big reward. <laughs> a robot go boo! Yes, robot go boo. How many of these do I have to carry? Patrick must like the hey, Avengers. Because robot go boom. They have clam sickles. I missed two of them, but, you know, I don't need them all. Woo! Up we go! Whack a tiki. Uh, no. Yeah, I gotta say, I like the automatic aiming better in the PS2 version. Oh, okay, so I could go on over here. Oh, I could break these with- okay. Clever, I like it. That's basically them referencing the uh, Shine Get meme. This one Whoa. goes boom. Oh. oh, I thought that didn't hit me for a second, but it did. I was gonna say, oh, I'm lucky that didn't hurt me. Double jump on that. What do we got up here? SpongeBob needs bubble bowl. Ah, uh, okay. That's much better. Ouch! Ooh! Why is a whistle? Ooh. 
don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Hey, who are you? Okay, so I guess I go back to crabs. That's much better. There's still stuff over there, though. Not exactly what I had in mind. I hope my insurance covers all this. Why don't you try something less expensive? Or, I, I mean, dangerous. I need them crazy robots cleared out of the bumper boats. When you've destroyed them all, come back and see me. Okay, yeah, that's what I noticed. Let's go. Once again, times like this when you wish the characters had a sprint button. Hey, there's a spatula down there. Eh, I'm not gonna go for that. Drinks coral candy. Clemsicles. Toss a clam. Okay, so that was that it? I missed that at the end. Oh, come on. I got that. But guess you can't collect them in midair, so I guess there's something else I have to do before I'm able to get that. Oh, no. 
was close. Unless I can go up there. And then there's something else. Oh wait. Oh, I see, I see. It's a bungee jump. Smoothies! Yummy! Yes, here we go. Okay, now I go up there. And then I can get it. Makes sense. Got it. Now we have 20. Bumper cars are over there. I see there's a button. I'm gonna take a shortcut. Oh wow, it actually lets me go up here. I was thinking of changing back to Patrick, but man, I'll just do this in SpongeBob. Oh, I can't drive those. Sponge. There's something else down there, let me keep that in mind. gonna take me over there. Okay, there's a switcher. Let's do it. Surf's up. This one still doesn't do anything. Congratulations, SpongeBob! You're king of the beach! Here, have a golden spatula! Okay, there we go. 21. Fresh like a spring breeze. That's the main objective. I love opening presents. Although now we should go back and claim our other reward. Let 
You know what? Nah, I don't need it. <laughs> I'm not taking the time to do that. We've been in this level long enough. What? I don't know how that happened. Yeah, see, look, there was... There's no water here. Oh, there's a little tiny bit. Okay. So it... Alright, there was a little bit there, too. This is like Sonic Boom, where you just drown in knee-high water. <laughs> Good to know. If there's a tiny drop of water on the ground, you'll die. I call that a moment of video game logic. Bad video game logic. Speaking of which, new Among Us logic episode today. I gotta check that out later. There we go, Poseidon. Last week, I actually rewatched the entire series. It's great. Mark my words, Among Us Logic is the Spongebob of internet cartoons. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been breached. So is this gonna be Robo Patrick? Bring it on, your highness! Bring it on! In this corner, defending the Poseidon, a small square guy! Okay. Sandy. Look, it's a giraffe. Uh, I think I need to get home. <laughs> Look, it's a giraffe. <laughs> nice reference. Whoa. Ow! I guess SpongeBob will like be winning sponge. that way. There we go. Okay. Now the robot's taking a beating out there. I do like the um announcer. Bounce and throw the head, it says. Spring! Uh -oh. The old clothesline move! That's classic. The robot's losing its head! Okay, I can't. What a shocking takedown by Patrick! Right. There. How's that for staying one step ahead of you? Uh, now we're doing this again? Cool. Looks like Patrick has a big opportunity here! My head. Oh! Nice flying, uh, head 
Interesting move by Patrick. Patrick has a big opportunity go. here. That was a little bit delayed. But it still works. Wow! I've never seen such an electrifying oh, match. No, Your turn, SpongeBob. Oh. Uh, we Bounce and bash the head. Elbow drop. Spilling right, this... the old clothesline yeah. move. Ah. Okay. Fresh, yeah, that's like a, a little bit different breeze. now. Oh man. Oh. Oh, what an uppercut! Oh, barely missed that on me. Ow. Uh. I feel like a new spy. There's the robot's vulnerability. Let's see if SpongeBob. Oh, okay, goes so maybe that it. did work. Nice move by SpongeBob. This match is just about Last over. Last time, but now it just does that when you hit it. Ouch. Yeah. Fresh like a spring breeze. I don't think I'm ever gonna be able to jump over that. I mean, actually, I already blew all my chances because this will finish that it off. robot is down and staying down. Sweet victory! Hey, nice reference. Well, that was quite a battle. Oh, look at that poster in the background. You can see buff SpongeBob. But wait, there's more. A golden spatula, and that's not all. A gift certificate for five dollars and thirty-two cents to Dean's Little Shop of Dried Fish Flakes and Flowers. Oh, thank you. It all means so much. I. I. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Cry all you want, but not here. We just wax the floors. Well, now those waxed floors are probably filled with robot ash and sparks. Which will make the ash worse. Hey, Plankton! Yes, what is it? I was just wondering why all the robots seem to be coming from inside the chum bucket. Have they? I really haven't noticed. Uh, yeah. And then there's Sus. that big flashing neon sign that says, Robot Headquarters. SpongeBob, I'm your friend, right? No, not really. <laughs> exactly, and as your non-friend, I worry about you. Like right now, you're thinking too much. I'm worried you might really hurt yourself. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna think for you. This way, you won't hurt yourself, and you can just keep working on getting me into the chum bucket. Thanks, Plankton. You're the best non-friend a friend could have. No more thinking for me. Okay, new area. So of course this isn't 100% accurate to the show, but it's still, you know, good enough. Like the walk between Sandy's house and SpongeBob's house should be a little bit longer. Let me teach you how to bowl a bubble. Press ah, this here we go, bubble bowl. And you'll bowl a bubble that can knock down robots from a safe distance. Wow! Remember though, the probably my favorite bubble only works on things that are upgrade. close to the ground. Got it. Flash, sponge wearing five pairs of underwear coming through. I feel like a new sponge. Okay. I probably can't jump all of those hills.
Eh, let's try it out. Yeah, can't. Invisible wall. 40 spatulas over there. So what can we do inside Sandy's house? Sandy, your tree dome is leaking! Them there robots busted up the glass, SpongeBob! I got a treehouse chock full of robots and it's all your fault, so get in there and clean up your mess! This looks really good in HD. Oh wow, like that can one-shot them? Of course, I love the Bubble Bowl because it's basically a ranged attack. And if you guys saw my Avengers live streams, you guys know that um, I favor ranged attacks. Like, obviously, it's not SpongeBob shooting a gun, but, like, you know. It's still a ranged attack. Alrighty then, that's much better. I suppose you'll be needing this more than me. It's cool to see that was dried up SpongeBob. Oh, and here's the table he sat at. I don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. Yeah, that was a cool idle animation. Fresh like a spring breeze. You see him uh adjust his tie. Hey, it spins when you hit it. I love it. Is that a uh, accurate simulation of what happens inside of Bill Dozer's brain? The world may never know. The Shady Shoals. Wow! Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy! My heroes! Hit me with the water ball! Hit me, hit me, hit me! Eh, we don't do that stuff anymore, kid. We're retired. Is that the TV repairman? No, it's that excited sponge kid again. Oh! Uh, are you sure he can't fix the TV? Mermaid Man, twould be my greatest honor to fix your television. Good be! Hey, Sponge Kid, you really want to help out? No oh boy, would I? Okay then, uh, but lighten up a bit on the enthusiasm, huh? Uh, you're making my bowels act up. Uh, we've got a little problem with some robots down in the Mermelair. Are you sure you're up to this task? Absolutely, Barnacle Boy! Well, go over to the couch to access the Mermelair. We'll meet you down there. Is it pudding night yet? Ah, the mermaid look. The Mermelair. We're gonna meet Crom. Hey, want to see me de get demonetized? Want to see me do it again? <laughs> I love opening presents. If you know, you know. My videos are monetized in the first place, so, you know, I can't actually get demonetized <laughs> by doing this, but, you know, uh, if they ever do someday, um, this is not going to get me anywhere. <laughs> I 
Ah, this mission doesn't require any amount of golden spatulas. Saving game, okay. Boy. Ah! You shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. Come to think of it, nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your awesome presence gives me the chills of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps <laughs> on my... All right, kid. Knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick sat on my old ones. That's not what uh. I meant. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up, young sponge of goodness. It is? It is? Yes. A bunch of evil robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. It's up to you to shut it down and stop them. Well, why him? We're perfectly capable superheroes. Because it's Thursday, and we have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Oh, ah, snap. fish sticks. I forgot. Go talk to the Mermelair computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. I accept this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Man. You won't be disappointed. Shamed, maybe, but not disappointed. To the doctor's office! Away! Yeah, I gotta get to those doctor's appointments. It's important. It's not just any sponge. It's Super Sponge. Soaking up crime. <sighs> There's super nothing sponge. like the smell of bubbles in the I morning. was actually in Smells like another SpongeBob game. So does that hurt me? Okay, don't step on the red squares. The others are fine. I get it. So if I step on a yellow square, I'll be okay. Whoa. This robot is named Arf. Use the bubble bowl to defeat him. Yeah, it's not a good idea for a sponge to absorb a fire. Well, back the way. Sponginator. There, that takes care of that. Those things remind me of bomb bombs from Mario. Or a uh, grenade from Skylanders, if you will. Bubble Wool can also be used to press buttons. Oh, that guy almost hit me.
So that was a pretty short le level segment. No long objective to do for a spatula. You just the get up there Mayor. and get out. Secret fortress of the wrinkly superheroes, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Hey, I thought you guys had a doctor Squidward, appointment. Am I happy to see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. Oh, you'll never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermalair computer. But since you're here now, I'll let you do it. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rugs? And all this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all this? Oh, that's easy. In episode 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and they... Never mind! Hmm. There's a launcher here. Interesting. There's nothing like Whoa. the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. You're my hero. Hey, you're yellow. When did that happen? Somebody who can throw things! Leave it to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel machines. Throw throw oh, the throw through fruit? No, throw the throw fruit! Throw the tofu. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. I mean they tend to explode! I tend to explode. Ah, overshot. that no okay it's just gonna yep Ouch. oh no When you get really close to it, it's going to be hard to avoid that. Yeah. 
And great, he overshot it. Now I have to wait forever for the thing to reappear. There's a pattern to it. Um, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. Alright, so now it's not going to shoot at me. That was easy. So that's it. Now I just go here. Hey, I know you! You're that guy! Hmm. I'm gonna need a lot more power to activate the hydroacoustic Doppler modulator. Do you think you can handle this? I could see Squidward's house from up here. And he's not wearing any pants. Oh wait, he never wears pants. Now listen up. There are eight cylinders over there. If you throw something at the cylinders, it'll turn around to the power side. Turn all eight cylinders around to the power side and I'll give you a reward. Explain Sorry, it for dumb dumb what was Patrick. That? I was watching Squidward. Just start turning those cylinders. Oh, okay, there's a pattern to it. Not what I meant to do, but it seemed like that worked. Uh, one's not right. I know that was fine, but I'm just doing a reset, if you will. I have a feeling we're going to be here for a long time. You sure got to carry a lot of stuff around. No, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, so that that's seems to be okay. No, that's not what I wanted to do. 
Well, this... Yeah, but that changes the other one. No, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, see, this is my problem. Everything is right except for one. So, like, what do I do? Just do the whole thing again? Is that finally it? Oh no. There's one over here. Yeah, see now that affects the other one. I think right here. Yeah, see what I mean? Now now that just affects the other one. So it's like back to square one. There we go.
Ah, well done. Now there's enough power. What do you need all that power for? Why, my foot bath, of course. Here, have a golden spatula. Hey, look at that. Super spatula seeker. Get 25 spatulas. Now, how to get some bath salt? Is this where I came from? Oh. Ah, he shouldn't have. That hitbox range is new. Okay, so I need SpongeBob. I always like that bus animation. Falls into place like perfectly. A new sponge. Uh, oh, I almost got electroshocked. Sponges should not absorb electricity. Oh no, another one. It shines. Tongue slide. Fresh like a spring breeze. So now we're back here, although there's this conveyor belt. Oh. Jumped right into that. I feel like a new sponge! By the way, when I was playing this in the summer of last year is actually um, when I got the idea for the um, project that I'll be doing. Little fun fact. So that would have been August 2019. You're my hero. Hey! You're... Hmm. Is he gonna say anything? When I do this? You did it! Now I can get some sleep! Okay, nice. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! That makes 26.
I went up here already, but there's there must be something I missed. Yes, there is. A button. Left wall jump activated. So let's see, is there anything up here I missed? Okay. And there is one little problem I have with the bubble bowl, and it was like this in the original too, is that he always go he always steps forward when you There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. It. Smells like victory. So that's a little tiny Bravo problem I have with it, but other than that it's great. Okay. I went over here, but it did say something about wall jump activated. Ah, yes, here we are. Seven. We're getting them pretty good. Which, by the way, 27 system, is the channel for Nickelodeon. Spread throughout the on my cable. The first one is here. Press the button. Got it. When by the way, fun fact. Um, you should return with the computer, the, the game has to have button. an actual character to speak to. Rewarded. I don't know if they did this in this version too. Return here. Got it. Are you listening to me? Listening! Got it! But uh, basically, uh, they actually have Barnacle Boy hidden inside the computer. So that he acts as the NPC you talk to. Since the game has to work like that to have it work. SpongeBob, press all of the security override buttons throughout the Mermelair. to the deepest recesses of the Mermelair. Wow. Oh, you took the elevator. Oh, how do I get to the top of this room? Wow. You're right. I bet those tunnels will take me up to the top. Good thinking, Gary. <laughs> You've just met the Spongeinator. Pretty cat, take it! like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. Alright, I'm gonna challenge myself. Let's see if I can get the bubble bowl to hit that TP. Mm. 
now. Can I use this on him? Oh, I can! That's cool. But of course, it's still the circle button, so... It still means you have to use a circle attack. Oh, wow. You know, this is remind... This reminds me of Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric. You know, never played the game still, but I've seen it, of course. Man, the electricity is really bright. I mean, this is a pretty colorful game, but still, wow. There. I was able to hit that one with the bubble bowl. Okay, I did not think that was gonna work, but you know, worth a shot. Ah! Uh. Okay. Take it out. Fresh like a spring breeze. Okay, thankfully the invincibility frames were nice to me. I feel like a new sponge. Did the explosion hurt him? Ah, well that one hurt me. Okay, that just collapses. 28. Already close to 30. What can I do here? What's on the upper path? I think I'll save my shinies. Rolling Ball Arena? Oh no. On second thought, I think I'll be going up. That's the area with the puzzle that I can never figure out. I fell, so now I'm... Wait, was there a box back there? It doesn't look like it. So, ah, uh, seems like we're taking the long way. This is always what I hate about platformers like this. Oh, okay. As long as these pants are square and this sponge is Alright, well, that may have actually saved me time. So I'll take it. Last second.
Let's just do that to save time. Good time for you to do that. To do laundry. Okay. Well, that was just for a sock, but all right. I figured there would be more. But all right, let's proceed. Does this hurt me if I touch it? Oh, okay. It looks like I can do something with this later. Ah, there it is. The golden spatula. Just hidden in there, teasing me. I was I was never able to figure this out. Even when I played this two years ago, I, I still couldn't figure out how to do like that. Huh. Interesting. Seems like a passive thing. Now, what did that do? Oh, okay, so this is for the ball puzzle, I guess. Man, but this game and Sonic 06 having confusing ball puzzles. Then again, I guess I'm hey, confusing because of the bad physics. Number one in the Bikini Bottom Scavenger Hunt. All years running. buttons pressed. Oh, thank you. Let's see if I could do this. Probably not, but I'll give it a shot. Ah, uh, okay, so I guess I have to go up there. Huh. Okay. Oh, I guess I have to press that and then go up there. <sighs> There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. 
Ah. That's gonna lose me a bit of time. Ah. Oh, I guess I have to time it right too. Ah, forget that. Back to the main chamber. I have regained control of the security system. Here is the reward I promised you. You have pressed all the security buttons. Now press the master shutdown button. should go help Mermaid Man. He's in the villain containment area. So where is that? Ah, uh, right. I can go across here now. Enter the villain containment system area. Okay, so we don't have to make that very long walk. Well, the security system has been shut down, and we got a good checkup. Hooray for justice in all its multi-splendor glory! Yeah, well, Justice Boy. Checkup? I saw you guys hanging around here. BCS. That's villain containment system. Is that bad? Does Mermaid Man? I guess they could have gotten it while I was doing all that puzzle stuff. Oh no! It looks like one of the villains has broken free. What's that? An evil doer on the loose? Who is it? Man Ray? The atomic flounder? The dirty bubble? No, worse than that. He's your arch enemy. Prawn. Prawn! Did someone call? Oh, I thought maybe I was looking at super. Oh, Prawn. Why did I say Prawn? Oh, you know what? Krom is a Smash Bros. Prawn! character, isn't he? I can see you how I could get that confused. What it do? does sound similar. The worst thing you can imagine. He put all of Mermaid Man's white clothes in the washer with a red sock. Everything I own turned pink. 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 How horrible! Personally, I thought pink made you very pretty. Really? Sure, pretty stupid. Well, I know what color he's not picking in Among nice. Us. What is that yellow thing? Some kind of mold? I'm not mold, I'm a sponge! There's a cellular difference! A cellular difference! Yeah, yeah, thanks for the lesson, Dr. Science. See you later, Pinky! By the seven seas, Prawn, I shall not rest until you are captured! But first, I shall have to change from my secret identity into Mermaid Man! You don't have a secret identity, you old coot. Maybe you better take care of Prawn while I take care of this. I shall avenge you, Mermaid Man! Well, this is a cool fight from the man. I don't even have to get close.
not again! This is not fair! I got a frozen wedgie for this! Is this the end of Prawn? Prawn is safely locked away again! That was actually Thanks pretty easy. You, Frankie! My name's SpongeBob. Here! But I guess it was I fun. So, hey. Still drawer. pretty good fight, I Next guess. to a bunch of pink socks! It's another golden spatula! Thank you, Mermaid Man. I shall always live my life by your shining example. Let goodness and kindness... Are you still here? <laughs> Shrimp catcher. Defeat prawn in the mermaid lair. Okay. I like checking just in case he says something funny. He's not here. Huh. I guess I didn't think that we would look. And maybe it was also like that in the PS2 version, so they just kept it like that. Fresh like a spring breeze. Okay, now let's get out of here. Uh oh. That jump looked further than it was. Ah, uh, well. Actually, I do not believe there's a way back from here. So I guess that's going to be it for today. I might do more tomorrow, but I'm not sure. Because uh, my sister and I might be playing Genshin Impact tomorrow. Uh, we haven't gotten the chance to play yet. And also, um, I am noob. I only started playing like last month. But she's been playing ever since it came out. So yeah, we'll see what happens, but until then, thanks for stopping by. Take care, everybody.